So what is this tap follower even for? Well, when you tap a hole, in the past I've always had to drill the hole like I just did, and then I take this somewhere else out of the drill press uh, or the mill or whatever, and I take it over to a vise, and I would, and I would then put the tap on there and try to line that up, and then look this way and line that up, and then I'm spinning it around and I'm trying to keep the tap perfectly vertical. And you can use little blocks beside it to help you, and that that works. But especially if you're tapping a lot of holes, it's um, it's kind of annoying. It's not perfect. Well, here's your tap follower. This is what this does. Now I haven't moved. You don't want to move your setup. Use the exact same setup that you just used to drill the hole. Now I can bring the quill down into the center of my tap handle and put some spring tension on it so it can travel a little bit. So now, put a little cutting on there, oil on there for the tap. Now I can turn this handle and it's getting pushed in. It's getting held perfectly vertical as I work and I can go forward and backwards and the spring allows it to move both directions. It just makes tapping holes Efficient, easy, and more importantly to me, perfect. Because there's no way that that hole is not perfectly in line with the drill bit that just drilled it. Now any good tap handle is going to have a center on the back. Now this is a small tap, so it doesn't have a center. But a bigger tap will have a center on it. And that's there to go into a tap follower. And then with this kind of handle, you can still see that center. So the tap follower can still guide that tap, even with that handle on. So the same is true in the lathe. So if I need to tap that hole, when you finish your drilling operation, Take out your bit, put in your tap follower, get your carriage out of the way, put a little tension on it, start tapping. You can see it comes forward as I go forward, it backs off when I back off, keeps it dead center the whole time. Very handy. So I've been wishing I had one of these for a long time, but no more. Thanks Tubal Cane.